Guy Kitchen. <laughs> Two and oh. Congratulations. Thank you very much. We got the win. Um, I've just said before I put the camera on that this should be the detention room yeah. and not the post fight interview room. <laughs> so, for anyone who is watching the post fight interview before they've seen the fight on YouTube, please go back and watch it. And if you haven't seen Guy's first fight, watch that too. Um, Talk to me. Yeah, Talk me through the fight, guy. It started off well. Boxing, well, all right. Do you know what I mean? I know how much better I can be than that, but I think I just switch off and just get lazy and just, just didn't fight, enjoy fighting, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, that's the problem, though. You, yeah, and he literally, you said that, and you say it with a smile on I your know, face. I know, I know, but I need to learn from it, and I do. And it is... It's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what I mean? He punches the I never fucking... There's never nothing I'm like, oh, fucking, what an idiot. So the thing, the thing, like I say, yeah, the first three rounds, you box comfortably. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah. You just got sloppy and just got drawn in and just, what am I doing? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. And I've got a quote written down here, um, <laughs> <laughs> and it was from your brother from the last fight, oh, and it said, oh, "Guy, no, 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 no. everyone loved it." But don't do it again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What are we talking about, guy? No, what happened in round four? I don't know. I just got sloppy again. Um, yeah. So no, no, it wasn't even like it wasn't nothing like last one. That was yeah. But it would, it would just like a, see you fucking later. Do you know what I mean? I thought you little bastard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So there was that, there was that knockdown in the fourth round. Yeah. Um, and like you say, in the first fight, in that round three, that was a. A heavy knockdown, and I don't know how anybody oh, got yeah. back from that. And you went on and you boxed yeah, another round. Not, no. And this today, for me, was a, a bit of a, a switch off moment. Yeah. Um, and uh, you do what it was. I loaded up, and he just swiped up, fuck off. You know what I mean? Like that. Do you know what I mean? And I was already, I was off balance throwing the shot, and he just knocks you. Just see you later. Do you know what I mean? Fuck off. See you later. <laughs> And it, and it doesn't hurt, it doesn't, I don't even feel the shot, it's just like, a, like getting it with a jab, do you know what I mean? And I just think, what are you doing, do you know what I mean? And it, it's, I, I can learn from it though again, it's just... I think it's safe to say, the thing is, it, you're an exciting fighter guy. Yeah. I, like, I'm talking to you now and you can see I'm smiling just as much as you are by the other side of this. And like I said, I loved watching your fight. It was a barnstorm in your debut. It really, really was. And again, it's got everybody up on their feet, having a great time. And you, you're going to bring the fans back again. I've just seen you pick up your tickets for your next fight. I can guarantee that they are going to be flown out of the door before you've even got back to Harrogate. So, so. um, and on that note, um, yeah, yeah, you're from Harrogate, guy. Yeah, I keep going on Don saying Doncaster. I'm not from Doncaster. <laughs> I'm from Harrogate. Um, so yes, according to Boxrec, it is Harrogate. Yeah, so yeah. we will go with that information. Oh, definitely Harrogate. Good knows where the MC got his from, but yeah, uh, we yeah. can only apologise for that. Um, but yeah, you are two and zero, and it's learning fights, and you are learning yeah, yeah. each and every time. But I never take bad fights. Never just bums or anything like that. I always get someone who's going to come for a fight, and that's what I like. Because I'm not, I'm, I'm sorry, but I can't have one of these people that just sit there and just fucking. I mean, this fella runs a bit, but he comes. If you if you hit him, he comes back for a fight. See, that, that's really interesting. So for, again, so it's Victor Adagar, isn't it? That yeah. you just that you just boxed. Um, and if people have seen him on the circuit a little bit, he can run and he can, can hold horrible, and can he can horrible. be a bit of a pain in the, yeah. the backside to, to box really yeah. but yeah when you caught him with a shot he started to come forward which I think potentially made it more fun for you because know, then you could go out there and have that bit of a fight um, and, and the, you know you've reflected on that just in the walk down um, through the changing rooms uh, guy so taking away from this then what do we work on and what do we come back with in round a lot, five, a lot, right? a lot of things just concentration just keeping that concentration, keeping, it's just, I just switch off and I need to stay switched on the whole fight instead of switching off for like a couple of minutes here, a couple of minutes there thinking, yeah, let's have a fight and enjoy, trying to enjoy yourself. But no, it's about winning. It's time to be a bit selfish. Sorry to the people who are coming and watching, but I need to start boxing more and 
Boxing making clever. Making it so exciting, yeah. Yeah, no, absolutely. Um, you know, it's a short career anyway, is boxing. Um, but we want to see you around for, for as long as we can. Um, and so, yeah, we'd love to see we'd love to see you back again. And your face does light up when you talk, <laughs> when you talk about boxing. And I wrote that on my notes, watching yeah. some of your previous interviews. So I was excited to, to, to chat with you anyway. Um, and you've been sparring Callum Simpson, yeah, no less, been. who's currently out abroad with um, Better BF yeah. uh, in his camp. Yeah. So you, you're sparring some really high class talent. Oh, definitely. Um, and I'm sure they're teaching you and you're learning from them. Oh, I learned loads from Callum, absolutely. Loads more than anyone. You, do you know what I mean? You're not going to learn anything from anyone else really much better. Yeah. He's probably one of the best people to learn off, definitely for me. Absolutely. And how important is it to go in? Um, in the comfort of your gym with these high level operators in preparation for the big lights. When you sign them, it's just, you just think, oh, you know what I mean? These people out here are nothing compared to these lads in there. You know what I mean? So it's you now. And could that potentially be a reason why we do maybe switch off almost Definitely. taking it for granted? So. I, I, think, I think it's a bit of that and a bit of just, you know, just that, it, I don't know, it's just that. Just, Love it. You know I, mean? <laughs> and I think I enjoy myself a bit, you know, switching off. But then it's just stupid because I can box and everything. I just need to go back to it. I think I need to just stick to doing what I know I can do. I mean, even when I was boxing, that I wasn't showing half of what I can, I can do. Do you know what I mean? I can box so much better than that. But it's time to just start showing it. I think. Well, we've enjoyed watching you, <laughs> nevertheless. Um, you have moved to 2-0, yeah. remaining undefeated. Guy, congratulations. Thank you. I've loved it. <laughs> they loved it. And I'll look forward to seeing you again really Thank soon. You. <laughs> For all boxing, info, news and latest interviews, Amateur and Pro, across and off, click and subscribe. VIP, boxing promotions. Also, Twitter, Instagram and Facebook.